namo bhagavate vasudevaya om namo bhagavate vasudevaya namo bhagavate vasudevaya Tonight we're going to speak on the Chatur Sloki of the Bhagavad Gita, the four verses which are the nutshell verses of the Bhagavad Gita. Hare Krishna, so on behalf of uh, Alusta, Namahat, we like to invite His Holiness Bhakti Vikramadasa Narasimha Maharaj for His uh, mercy. Maharaj is here to bless this center and also uh, to cover His mercy upon the devotees here. Thank you very much, Maharaj. Thank you. Uh, Maharaj, uh, for the new devotees, uh, for your information, Maharaj is the direct disciple of the founder Acharya, Abhay Charanda Bhaktivedanta Swami Maharaj, and one of the initiating gurus of Ishkon. Eh? And now Maharaj has been, uh, to my knowledge, Maharaj has been preaching in Malaysia for the past 25 years. Eh? And Maharaj also has cultivated many disciples all over the country, and the disciples are also doing very well. So this is another plus point for the development of this population. Thank you very much, Maharaj. So Maharaj is the pro bar of the area distributor. Now, for now, the pro bar of Pakamale, our Bhutirom Bhutirom is very strong. Our little area is just coming in. Can you na? Can we pray for the one? Ah, for the one is the Anpakal. Let's na, we need to talk now. In three, the Maharaj is the. Amade yang bandar kita orang, kita orang ramai nanti. Maharaja anda, nama orang ini Iskon, di sini guru mara kita luar beri. Kerana hari ini kita sihir orang orang, Maharaja orang kerana ini nalar hari ini berpakar lagi, lagi orang hari berpakar itu orang orang. Jadi pada itu Maharaja orang orang ini, anak bulan, bagus itu seperti orang orang itu. Maharaja anda ini kiri, pada itu kita yang catur sulok orang orang. Nanti mukti emana sulok orang orang itu, pada itu kita hilang. Anda nangke petri marai berdua. So the chapter sloki of the Bhagavad Gita comes in the tenth chapter, which is the Vibhuti Yoga. Now it's like that. In the chapter sloki, Gal Bhagavad Gita yang pertam atiaya kilbari bintrane. In the atiaya Vibhuti atiaya bintre pelangga pergi bintre. In the ninth chapter, Lord Krishna had spoken. The most confidential knowledge. One bada matya yethil Krishna Bhagavan mija ragasiya man ari vai patri besi rikra. Arjuna was very inspired to hear all this from Lord Krishna. Idhar lam kert bader ke Arjuna mija vom aru maagi rindar. So then Lord Krishna went on to give this. Essence of the Bhagavad Gita in four verses. Adan Paragya Krishna Bhagavan in the Nang Padangalin Mola Maga Bhagavad Gita in Saratai Padangiri Kendra. The verses of the Bhagavad Gita, like the verses in the Vedas or any scripture, they come in three different levels. Matra Matra Sastrangalin Padiye Bhagavad Gita Yom. The three levels are called Sambandha, Abhidaya and Triojana. Sambandha means knowledge of the relationship between the living entities and the Lord. And the Padini Legal in the Sambandham Abhidaya Priyojana. Some Mudali Sambandham and Bade Krishna Bhagavan Udan Namakirin Kindra Uravai Patriya. Then Abhidaya 
is talking about the process of devotion of self. Grandavade, Abideya and Bade, Bhakti Tundin, Pali Muragale, Pratavade. So first there's the Abhidaya, the relationship, and then how to act in that relationship. And then we will hear Prayojana, the goal of that process. We're going to do Bhakti Yoga. We're going to chant Hare Krishna. We're going to do service for Krishna. What's the goal? What's the purpose? So in four verses, Lord Krishna describes these three different levels. In the moon, Padi Nilegalayo, Krishna Bhagavan, in the Nandi Slogan Gali, Vrakandra. So Lord Krishna begins in chapter 10, text number 8. He describes first of all sambandha, the knowledge of the relationship. He says, Aham Sarvasya Prabhavo Mata Sarvam Prabhantate Iti Madhva Bajantimam Buddha Bhava Samandhita. Lord Krishna is saying that He is the source of everything material and spiritual. And the wise who know this will worship Him with love. Idil Bhagavan, Anaiti Chada Anmi Gangalakum Molamanavar Krishna Bhagavani. Idai Unaranda Mahatma Kal, our in Bhakti Tondi, Idu Bhattavaragalagi. So everything, material and spiritual, it's all coming from Krishna. There is a material world and there is also a spiritual world. And they both come from Lord Krishna. Lord Krishna lives eternally in the spiritual world, in Goloka. Krishna Bhagavan But there is also a section in the spiritual world by Kuntha where Lord Vishnu is living. And the Anmiga Logatil Vaikundam and Rapagadi Mirikindra Angedan Vishnu Vasikindra. The devotees of Lord Krishna generally they go to Goloka. Those who are devotees of Lakshmi Narayan, they will go to Vaikuntha. Krishna Bhagavan in Bhaktargal, Goloka Trikisilvargal. But both places are in the spiritual world. And they are both coming from Lord Krishna. Now, as well as the spiritual world, there is also this material world. And we are on one planet, in one universe, but there are countless universes in the whole material world. And the Anmiga Loga Tirtipal, Baudiga Loga Mirikindra, the Pala Prabhanjangal Rikindra, Namwal Kindra in the Prabhanjam, Pala Prabhanjangal Rikindra. And the whole spiritual world is three times the size of the material world. Now just imagine how great is the spiritual world. 
முக்கால் பகுதி என்றால் இந்த ஆன்மீக பரவெளி எவ்வளவு பெரியது என்று நினைத்து பாருங்கள் Everyone has a spiritual body which is eternal full of bliss and knowledge. ஆன்மீக லோகத்தில் இருக்கின்ற ஒவ்வொருவருடையும் உடலும் நித்தியமானது அறிவுமயமானது ஆனந்தமானது. We are all spiritual but we are living in a material body. நாம் கூட ஆன்மாதான் உணர்வை வளர்த்து கொண்டால் நாமும் ஆன்மீகமாக இருக்க முடியும் தற்காலிகமான உடலில் இருந்து நாம் விடுபட முடியும் எனப்படுகின்ற நித்தியமான ஞானமயமான ஆனந்தமயமான உடலை பெற முடியும் They're full of misery and they're not very knowledgeable there's a lot of ignorance in our material body naam inda jada udalil irukkum bolude namakku adu nirandramaanadu allada nithiyamaanadu alla miga inbamaanadu alla pala thunbangalai kondathu adhe nerathil adhigamaana arivai kondathum alla we are on one planet in one universe our universe is quite small compared to other universes naam inda prapanjathil oru logathil vaalugindrom matra prapanjangalai kaatilum naam vaalugindra inda prapanjam siriyadhu dhaan and the planet earth is situated in the middle of the universe there are 14 different levels of planetary systems and the earth is situated number 7 inda prapanjathil பதினாலு லோகங்கள் இருக்கின்றன இந்த பதினான்கு லோகங்களில் நமது இந்த பூலோகம் ஏழாவது இடத்தில் இருக்கின்றது இந்த பூமியிலிருந்து மேலே போனால் சுவர்கலோகம் இருக்கின்றது அங்கே தேவர்கள் வாசம் செய்கின்றார்கள் We know the devas there are many demigods in charge of the affairs of the material world. In the baudhiga ulagai paramaripadarkaga pala devargal irukkindranar. They also have material bodies. Avargalum kuda baudhiga ulagai thaan vaithirukkindranar. They also die one day. Avargal kuda oru naal irandu povargal. So the demigods are not the supreme controllers in the devargal parama kattupaatalargal alla they just like sometimes you get politicians sometimes the politician wins the election he becomes very powerful and it, but then after some time he loses the election he goes out of favor id eppadi endral sila samayangalil arasiyal vaadigal irukkindraargal therdalil vetri petru padaviki varuvargal பிறகு தேர்தலில் தோற்று போய் பதவியை விட்டு விலகி விடுவார்கள் ஒரு சமயத்தில் அவர் இந்த நாட்டின் பிரதமராக இருக்கலாம் ஆனால் மறுகணம் அவள் சிறைச்சாலைக்கு செல்லலாம் தேவர்கள் தங்களுடைய புண்ணிய காரியங்களின் பலன்களினால் தேவர்களாக பிறப்படுத்திருக்கின்றனர் அவர்களுடைய புண்ணியங்கள் எல்லாம் முடிந்தவுடன் மீண்டும் இங்கே வருகின்றனர் இந்த தேவர்களின் சுவர்க லோகங்களுக்கு மேல் இன்னும் உயர்ந்த லோகங்கள் உள்ளன 
and on the very top of the universe you've got the planet of Lord Brahma. You've all heard of Lord Brahma. He is the first person in the universe, the first person to take birth. So, Lord Brahma, he lives at the top of the universe. But he's in the material world. And the nature of the material world is there is birth and there is death. The Bhagavad Gita tells us from the highest planet in the material world down to the lowest. All are temporary places of birth and death. In this way we understand how Krishna is creating everything, the material and the spiritual world. And there are the living entities. We, we are living entities. We are tiny parts of the Supreme. So Krishna has spiritual energy and he has material energy. And there is a third energy which is the marginal energy and we are the marginal energy. We are also the energy of Krishna. And we are called Tatastha Shakti, the marginal energy. Marginal means you can either be in the material or in the spiritual world. Just like if you go up to Padambasai, you can go across the border. You can be in Thailand or you can be in Malaysia. But you, cannot, you cannot just stay in between Thailand and Malaysia. You're either in Thailand or you're in Malaysia. So the same way, either we are in the material world or in the spiritual world. You come in the material world, you take a material body, you suffer birth, old age, disease, death. In the Baudiga Logatrika Nam Mandal, Nam, Parapu, Irapu, Pini, Mupu, in Ratumbangalak, Kandipaga, Ulaganerita. And you go to the spiritual world, there's no birth. There's no death, there's no old age, there's no COVID. <laughs> that is only eternal life of bliss and knowledge. But Lord Krishna created this material world why did he create it? Because we wanted to be separate from him. We chose to come into this world where we could be independent. 
நான் சுதந்திரமாக இருப்பதற்காக இந்த பௌதிக லோகத்தை தேர்ந்தெடுத்திருக்கின்றோம் You go in there, you stay in that world, and you can do what you like. Adanal Krishna Bhagavan, Ningal Gurimbhuna Gurimbhukiriyirgal, Ange Chellingal, Ningal Gurimbhiyade Chayyingal Endru Namma Inge Anipirikindra. But you're under the law of the material world. Anal Ingu Naam Inda Baudhiga Logatil Sattatitangal Inge Utpatirikindrom. The laws are there. The law that when you take birth, Because you take birth, you have to die also. Vidhi Marayana Vendral, Parapadu Thal, Nichiyamaga, Irakta, Meridum. And if you do good, you get good. But if you do bad, you get bad. Nallazu Seidhal, Nallazu Nadakkum. Thiyavai Seidhal, Thiyavai Thal, Nadakkum. You get the reactions for the work which you do. நிச்சயமாக நாம் செய்கின்ற காரியங்களுக்கு நீங்கள் எதை விதைக்கின்றீர்களோ அதையே அறுவடை செய்வீர்கள் You will harvest melon. You plant beans. You will harvest beans. Ingal pusani payin seidal pusani arivade seivirgal. Dani engal arivade seidal dani engalai arivade seivirgal. Shan yo shan bao er yo er bao. You do good, you get good. You do bad, you get bad. Nalla se seidal nalla de kadekyo. Tiya vai seidal tiya vai kadekyo. This law is there for everyone all over the planet. Illa logangalukku me idu poduvanadhu idu dhan sattathittam. This is a material world. Idu baudhiga ulagam. And there are laws. Ingu sattathittangal ullana. But in the spiritual world there are no laws like that. Aanal aanmiga logathil idu pondra sattathittangal kedaiyadhu. Because in the spiritual world everyone is a pure soul in andral aanmiga logathil ovvoruvarum parisuddhamana aathmaakkal in order to go to the spiritual world you have to be a pure soul in the aanmiga logathirkku chella vendumana naam parisuddha aanmaavaga irukka vendum so how to become a pure soul eppadi parisuddha aanmaavaga maaruvathu that is explained in the second verse of the chatur shloki of the bhagavad gita idhu dhan bhagavad gitayil இரண்டு இந்த அத்தியாயத்தில் இரண்டாவது சதுர்லோகத்தில் விளக்கப்பட்டுள்ளது நித்யாமந்திச்சாரி great satisfaction and bliss by enlightening one another and conversing about me yanadu bhaktargalin ennangal ennai saarndunnana ennil avargal saranadaindirukkindraargal ennai patri oru oru koruvar upadesikolvadilum pesikolvadilum avargal perum aanandamum triptiyum adaigindranar So this is the abhidaya this is a process of devotion of service how do we practice this bhakti yoga idu dhan abhideyam adavadhu eppadi naam inda bhakti vali muraiyai paithi seigindrom endru vilakkuvathu the practice of bhakti yoga is based on hearing and chanting inda bhakti yogathin vali murai mukkiyamanadhu ketpadhu In the beginning, we first hear. And by hearing, then things come about. Then you start to understand nicely. Mudali khet padhi. Thavana maga khet padan mola maga. Namaste. Yuvarangal ellam puri gintrana. Just like a little child will ask, "What is this? What is that?" They, they will ask to the parent. And the parent will explain, "Oh, that's a table. That's a book." And in this way, the child learns. Udaran terkik kulan dayal petrol orang kait kendra na. Ini yang na, adi yang na yang. Adat ke petrol gel, 
So in the same way the devotees will come together and they will read books like the Bhagavad Gita and they will discuss what the, what is the message of the Bhagavad Gita. And they will chant the magic, the Maha Mantra. They will chant the mantra and they will discuss how they feel. What is the effect of chanting the Maha Mantra? They will discuss the associate, how to associate with Krishna. They will discuss the different qualities and pastimes of Krishna. So the pastimes of Lord Krishna are very inspiring, very interesting to hear. And the devotees like to discuss what happened, what did Lord Krishna do? The devotees want to hear about Krishna's activities. We have to understand Krishna is a person. Just as we are persons, we are individuals. So Krishna is also a person. We are individuals, Krishna is an individual. We have to understand our relationship with him. Krishna Bhagavan Tani Nabar Namum Tani Nabargal Namuk Namida Mala Uravai Nam Purindu Gunavendam. We are all persons eternally we are persons. Not just for some time, but eternally we are persons. Namelam Narandara Maga Purishargal Tarkali Yamaga Allah. But we're not the body. The body is only like the vehicle. Just like you drive a car, you need a driver, you need the person to drive the car. A car doesn't drive on its own. So the body is like a car, like a vehicle. But the important thing is the driver, not the car. Not the car. So, Lord Krishna explains these things to understand the identity of the individual person, to understand who I am, that I am not the body, I am a soul living in the body. The body is material, but the soul is spiritual. So in Bhagavad Gita, Lord Krishna compares this body to the dress, to the clothes. Just like you wear some cloth, after some time the cloth becomes old becomes worn out and you replace it with the new cloth. Krishna Bhagavan Bhagavad Gita Yil Namadu in the Udalai Aadai Galikku Uppidu Gintrar Nam Aadai Anai Gintrom And the Aadai Alukagi Vittalo And the Kirindi Vittalo And the Aadai Yai Matri Kolgirom The same way with the body. The body takes birth, it grows for some time, then it maintains, then it may even produce some byproducts, but eventually it begins to dwindle and then finally it dies. 
குழந்தைகளையும் உருவாக்குகின்றது அதன் பிறகு நலிவடைகின்றது அதன் பிறகு அழிகின்றது just like you have a car and your car maybe you get a new car but it's not a new car forever after some time it starts to get old and you have to repair it and you have to put new parts into it and you have to try to keep it running overhaul it service it and so many things to try but eventually one day you know you have to get rid of the car நமது உடலும் ஒரு கார் போன்றுதான் முதலில் புதிதாக இருக்கின்றது பிறகு பல பழமையாகும் பொழுது அது கெட்டு போகின்றது அதை நாம் பழுது பார்க்கின்றோம் அதனுடைய சில பாகங்களை மாற்றுகின்றோம் அதனை சரி செய்கின்றோம் அதன் பிறகு சில காலங்களுக்கு பிறகு அது நிரந்தரமாக பயன்படுத்த முடியாமல் போகும் maybe you're a rich guy maybe you can get the mercedes or the bmw or something expensive cars ningal eppadi patta car il parapogindirgal ningal or selvandaraga irundal mercedes bmw pondra uyarthara car galai vaangivirgal so the same way somebody is done a lot of punya a lot of pious activities they can go to the higher planets maybe they'll go to swarga loka where the demigods live or maybe they'll even go up to brahma loka at the top of the universe ivarudan adhiga punyam seidha aanmaakal illogathirkku melulla swarga logangalukku devargalaga pirappidupargal illa endral adhilum miga uyarnda logamana brahma logathil ellam pirappidupargal in china they say ipan chian ipan ho you get what you pay for if you do a lot of pious activity you get the better body china the moliyil kuruvargal ningal enna kodukindrargalo adhil dhan ungalukku kidaikum but some these are sinful person did a lot of criminal things a lot of bad things he'll go down he'll go into the lower species நாம் எல்லாம் பல குற்றங்களை செய்து பல பாவங்களை செய்திருந்தால் நாம் கீழ்லோகங்களில் உள்ள பிறப்பெடுப்போம் இந்த பிரபஞ்சத்தில் பல விதமான படிநிலைகள் உள்ளன Just like you've got expensive cars and somebody else is on the bicycle சிலர் உயர்தர கார்களை பயன்படுத்தலாம் சிலர் சைக்கிளையும் பயன்படுத்தலாம் So you get what you pay for. நீங்கள் என்ன விலை கொடுக்கின்றீர்களோ அது உங்களுக்கு கிடைக்கும். We have to understand how to make good use of our time in the human body. இந்த மனித உடலில் நம் ஆயுளை எவ்வாறு சிறப்பாக பயன்படுத்தலாம் என்று சிந்திக்க வேண்டும். And Lord Krishna teaches us in the Bhagavad Gita the importance of devotion. developing devotion krishna bhagavan bhagavad gita el bhaktiyai valarthukollum mukhyatvathai vivarikkirar you know somebody is devoted to their dog they take a lot of care of their dog take their dog for a walk every day and do so many things maybe take the dog to the pet shop so they can give it a nice haircut and cut the fur and everything keep it nice make it look beautiful silar naigalukku seva seiya aasai padugindraargal sella praanigalukku seva seiya aasa padugindraargal sila samayam andha naayai sella praanigalin kadaigalukku eduthu chendru adarku alagaga mudivetti viduvaargal ipdi patta praanigalukku sella praanigalukku seva seiya silar thirumbugindraargal someone else is devoted to their football team You know I'm from England in England people are football crazy and everyone has their football team they're very devoted to their football team Sinar sila karpandu kulukalukku viswasigalaga irukkindraargal udhanathirkku naan England e serndavan naan England il irundal oru andha England kaarargal karpandu paikiyargal edhavadhu oru karpandu kulivirkku avargal viswasigalaga irupargal somebody is very devoted to alcohol they like to spend all their money in drinking alcohol sila per madubanangalukku ilakagi irupargal 
அதிகமாக செலவு செய்து மதுபானங்களை அருந்துவார்கள் so we all have devotion it's just a question of who or what are you going to devote yourself to ipdi ellam namakku bhakti irukindrathu aanal yaridam bhakti selutha pogindirgal endradhu mukkiyam so we learn from bhagavad gita that we should develop our devotion for lord krishna bhagavad gita in padi nammudaiya bhakti krishna bhagavan meedu irukka vendum endru koorapattirukkindru we should understand lord krishna is in the heart of all living entities naam purindukolla vendum krishna bhagavan ovvoru varudai idayathilum irukkindrar so we should be kind to all living entities adanal ella uyiru vaaligalidathilum naam karunai ullavargalaga irukka vendum means you should not eat meat fish and egg adana naam maamisamo meeno muttayo saapida koodadhu you should not kill the animals mrigangalai naam kolla koodadhu someone may say well you kill the plants isn't it the same if you kill the plants so you kill the animals what's the difference sila per kekkalam neengal ellam thavarangalai kollugindreergal mrigangalai kolvadhu thavarangalai kolvadhu enna veru paadi irukkindrathu endru but there is a difference anal vithyasam irukkindrathu plants and animals are different thavarangalum mrigangalum veru pattavai just like we don't eat people do you do you eat people தந்துக்கு மனிதர்களை நாம் உண்ணுகின்றோமா ஐ ஹோப் நாட் அது இல்லை என்று நம்புகின்றோம் வை நாட் बिकॉज people are different from the animal ஏனென்றால் மனிதர்கள் மிருகங்களிலிருந்து வேறுபட்டவர்கள் you eat the animals people don't say anything but you eat people if you cut chop up a person and cook them that's considered oh very bad மிருகங்களை உண்டால் யாரும் எதுவும் சொல்ல மாட்டார்கள் ஆனால் மனிதனை வெட்டி சமைத்து உண்டால் அது பெரிய விஷயம் பிரச்சனை மனிதனும் மிருகங்களும் வேறுபட்டவர்கள் அது போலவே மிருகங்களும் தாவரங்களும் வேறுபட்டவை plants and grains like rice here in alaska they grow so much rice around here that's the proper food for people thavarangal dhaniyangal udaranathirkku arisi alusaril neraya payiridapadugindrathu ivai dhan manidhanin unavu we don't need to eat animals naam murugathai unna vendiya avasiyam kedaiyadu of course if you if you very determined that you do want to eat animal then you can do it but you have to know how to do it maamisam unna koodadu endra urudhi nammidam irundal nichayamaga adai nammal vittu vida mudiyum aanal adai eppadi viduvadu endru theriya vendum we should never eat cow first of all that's a person cow is a special animal mudalavadaga pasuvin மாமிசத்தை உண்ணக்கூடாது அது ஒரு சிறப்பான பிராணி if you kill the cow or eat the cow meat it's very simple you get a lot of bad reaction பசுவை கொன்றோ அதன் மாமிசத்தை உண்டாலோ அது மிக மிக பாவமான காரியம் you want to eat meat all right you can take an animal like the goat மாமிசம் உண்ண வேண்டுமானால் ஆடு போன்ற மிருகங்களை உண்ணலாம் but only one day in the month on the dark moon night anal maadathil oru murai dhan adhavadu amavasai dinathandru on the dark moon night once in a month you go before goddess kali you kill that you can kill the goat i'm going to kill you in the future you can kill me maadathirkku oru murai kali devi idam sendru aadi idam nam koora vendum ippozhudhu naan unnai kollugindren piragi nee ennai koll endru you want to eat meat all right you kill me but in the future i will come and i will kill you nee ennai saapida vendum endral parava illai ennai kolla kolla vendum endral parava illai aanal piragu naan vandu unnai kolven so that's what happens if you want to eat meat you have to understand how to do it idhu dhan maami sammunnum vali murai idai naam purindukolla vendum but if we are intelligent and we can understand we don't need to eat meat nam arivaligala irundal namakku puriyum inda maamisathai 
The human body is meant to be a vegetarian, it's not meant to be a meat eater. If you study the anatomy of the body, the, how the body is designed, it's made in such a way that it's easy for us to eat vegetables and fruits and grain. It's not easy to eat meat. Our teeth are meant for grinding and crushing the grains. We don't have teeth like the tiger or the lion. They can tear the flesh and eat the flesh. And we don't have the strong acids inside our body that we can digest meat either. And that's why people who eat meat, they get easily stomach problems, they get a lot of health problems. So, we have to understand how to live in this world so that we can become a pure soul. We want to become a pure soul to go to the spiritual world, to get the spiritual body. So to become the pure soul, but one thing is don't eat the meat. Other things are also there. Don't take the intoxication. People who eat meat, they like to drink alcohol because it helps them to digest all the meat. So you see people who are meat eaters, they like to drink alcohol. But people who are vegetarian, they don't need to waste their money in alcohol. And that alcohol also very harmful. It burns all the organs inside the body. Just like even Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola also has caffeine in it. Caffeine is also drug. It's not good. If you put a coin in the Coca-Cola, the coin will come out very clean and sparkling because Coca-Cola is very acid. So the same way you drink that stuff, it burns all the organs inside your body. We are given everything we need by nature. Nice water is there. So many fruits are there. So many nice vegetables and grains. Everything is there that we need for the body, for our health. So intoxication, meat eating, these things are very harmful for the soul. They affect the mind and they make it very difficult for us to go out of the material world.
இவ்வாறு மாமிசம் முன்பது மதுபானம் அருந்துவதெல்லாம் இந்த ஆன்மீக வளர்ச்சிக்கு தடையாக இருப்பவை நம்மை ஆன்மீக லோகத்திற்கு செல்லாமல் தடுக்கக்கூடியவை So how to help us to follow to do these things and because it may be very difficult so in order to be vegetarian and to give up intoxication it becomes very easy if you chant the maha mantra ivare inda maamisa munbadu madubanathai vittu olippadarkellam enna vali endral nam inda hare krishna maha mantrathai jibippadu adanal idu sulabamagum because maha mantra will help us to control the mind and the senses nammudaiya manadhaiyum purangalaiyum kattupaduvatharkku inda hare krishna maha mantra japam udhavi seiyum so we don't say don't eat but we say eat pure food eat clean food saapida vendam endru nam yaariyum kooravillai aanal thuimayana unavai unnungal endru dhaan koorugindrom we have to know how to live in this world so that we can get the best result in the ulagil vaalvadana vaalvadarkku nalla nanmaiye peruvadarkku enna seiya vendum endru naan purindukolla vendum bhagavad gita says here that don't eat too much don't eat too little bhagavad gita kurugindrathu alavukku adhigamaga unnadirgal adhe velayil alavukku kuraivagavum unnadirgal some people think oh if i don't eat meat i'll starve i'll have nothing there, there's so much to eat there's so many nice vegetables and so many grains so many dishes and they sara nenikiram naan maami sam saapida vittal naan patti nikidakka neram endru illai mega alagana kai kerigal arumayana dhaniyangal ellam irukindrana you eat too little then you can get uh, tuberculosis tb மிக குறைவாக உண்டால் நமக்கு காச நோய் ஏற்படும் and you eat too much you get diabetes அளவுக்கு அதிகமாக உண்டால் நீரிழிவு நோய் டயபெட்டிஸ் வரும் diabetes the rich man's disease இந்த நீரிழிவு நோய் என்பது பணக்காரர்களின் நோய் so don't eat too much don't eat too little அளவுக்கு அதிகமாக உண்ணாதீர்கள் அதே வேளையில் அளவுக்கு குறைவாகவும் உண்ணாதீர்கள் Lord Krishna describes this is for the yogi practice of yoga you have to know you have to be regulated don't eat more don't eat less in the parindurai yogigalukkanadu yogathai payiruvadhu payiruvadhukkanadu alavukku adhigamaga unna koodadu kuraivagavum unna koodadu this so this is controlling the senses and all the senses are most difficult to control the tongue இதுதான் புலன்களை கட்டுப்படுத்துவதற்கான வழி புலன்களில் கட்டுப்படுத்துவதற்கு மிகவும் சிரமமானது நமது நாக்கு நாக்கினால் இரண்டு காரியங்கள் செய்ய முடியும் பேசுவது உண்பது அதனால் கிருஷ்ண பகவானுக்கு அர்ப்பணிக்கப்பட்ட தூய்மையான மரக்கறி உணவான பிரசாதத்தை உண்ண வேண்டும் and instead of talking all nonsense instead of talking all garbage things chant hari krishna mantra குப்பைகளையும் வெட்டி கதைகளையும் பேசுவதை விட்டுவிட்டு hari krishna maha mantrathai ஜெபிப்போம் so those two activities chanting hari krishna mantra and eating the spiritual food the prasada those two things can make it very easy for us to get out of the material world ivar hare krishna maha mandira te jebithukonde aanmiga unavana prasadathai ukkolvadan moolamaga inda baudhiga ulagathil irundhu naam vidupada mudiyum so this is a process of bhakti yoga idhu dhaan bhakti yogathin valimurai and then lord krishna also describes the the goal of this process prayojana the goal is to develop love for krishna இதன் பிறகு கிருஷ்ண பகவான் இங்கே பிரயோஜனம் அதாவது நோக்கம் ஆன்மீக பக்தியில் நிலை பெறுவது பற்றியும் விளக்குகின்றார் 
என்னை தொடர்ந்து வழிபட்டு என்னிடம் சரணடைந்தவதற்கு என்னிடம் வந்தடையக்கூடிய வழிமுறையை நானே காண்பிக்கின்றேன் என்று பகவான் கூறுகின்றார் கிருஷ்ணர் when we worship krishna krishna from the heart he helps us he gives us the knowledge to direct us how to come to him krishna bhagavan nammudan parimaatram seigindrar avarku anbodu bhakti thondu seiyum bolude namadu idayathil paramaatmavaga irundukonde namakku avar vali kaatukindrar and then krishna says in the final verse of the chatur shloki out of compassion for them i dwelling in their heart destroy the darkness born of ignorance with the lamp of knowledge ivari inda chadur shlokangalil nanthavathu shlokathil koorugindrar avargalin meedu ulla karunaiyinal avargalin idayathulla irulai agatri jnanam enum deepathai naan yetrukindren endru so we are in ignorance we are in darkness but this knowledge this light like the light when the light comes on there's no fear of dark anymore so the the light comes from the heart from krishna in the heart ariyama enbadu irulai pondrathu oli enbadu jnanathai pondrathu krishna bhagavan namadu idayathil irundukonde oli endra jnanathai yetrukindrar idanal nammadu ariyamai maraigindrathu and when we chant when we hear the holy name from the heart we will hear krishna speaking to us that this is very good that you should do this more ivara naam inda mahamandrathai kettukondi idana jabipadanal bhagavan idai thirundukonde idu migavum sirandathu endru namakku ookam alippar when you eat the food the spiritual food you say this is very nice i should eat this every day inda aanmeega prasadathai unnum poludhu nandraga irukkindrathu இதை நான் அனுதினமும் உண்ண வேண்டும் என்ற எண்ணமும் நமக்கு ஏற்படும் இதுதான் தன்னுணர்வு பெறுவதற்கான மிக சுலபமான வழிமுறை இதுதான் இந்த பௌதிக உலகத்திலிருந்து விடுபட்டு ஆன்மீக லோகத்திற்கு செல்வதற்கான மிக சிறந்த சுலபமான வழி கிருஷ்ணா ஹிம்சாப் கேம் ஹியர் டு டீச் us this knowledge இந்த ஞானத்தை நமக்கு வழங்குவதற்கான கிருஷ்ண பகவானே நேரடியாக வந்திருக்கின்றார் we should take advantage இதனால் நாம் நிச்சயமாக நன்மை அடைய வேண்டும் ஹரி கிருஷ்ணா ஹரி கிருஷ்ணா அதர் எனி क्वेश्चन எதும் கேள்விகள் எஸ் பிரோ ஒரு <laughs> they still have some suffering to undergo and that comes gradually until they gradually they're put into lower species of life after coming out of hell then they're put into animal bodies or lower bodies like that lower species of life and then gradually they come to the human form of life and then the human form of life then they may have some they may still have little bits of karma remain of course they do the coming gradually to the human form of life the, but generally it's in the human form of life where they get the karma they go to hell because of the sins they did they brought them into hell 
when the suffering is there, but it's not all there. Just like people go to prison, after they come out of prison, then the police will still check up on them. What are they doing out of prison? You know, they will, they will be like on, under the control of the police. They're not total, totally free. And the Tandanagala and Abu Talam Koda and the Pava Tilund, the Mudumayaga, Pudupatirka Matarga. A Puduza Avargal, Kil Prapagalana, Uriga Prapail and Pedu Pargal, Padipadiaga, we are the Madiza Previki or Vargal, Madiza Previlum Koda, Tama the Pavangal, Mutumaga, Aditirka Matargal, Alord is the Melum Pava Tayum, Sent the Pudvargal, Udana Turkey, Sari Chali Kitchen Raven, Sari Lend the Vidalayana Wooden, Avanai. So you want to avoid going to hell? There's a you can avoid it. You just have to chant the holy name of the Lord. Yamaraj is a god of death. And he's told all of his servants, never go to those people who are chanting the name of the Lord. But the sinful people generally they don't like to chant the names of the Lord. But sometimes you do get some sim simple people, sometimes they're fortunate. Somehow they get some good fortune. They may chant the holy name. And that can save them from being punished in hell. Yes. Millions of universes are created by Krishna. And each universe, uh, also you said about the Devi God, that's the Deva. Now the Devas, the 330 million Devas in one universe and another universe also 330 million? Creation. Prabhupada Kelvi. Pala Prabhupada Kelvi. Uppatthu Moondru Kodi Devar Kelvi Rikkirar Lentru Kura Pattru Kendradhi. In the Muppatthu Moondru Kodi Devar Kelvi in one universe, in another universe, uh, there are three animals, uh, or I just mentioned that the many gods in planet to be like in one universe. The other universe, also the same uh, planets, uh, the many gods are there, they are very clear. Yes. Ama, we bear Prabhupada Kongo. The Vedas tell us there are 330 million demigods. So in every universe, there's the level of the demigods, Swarga Loka, what they call the planets of the demigods. So in every universe, you have demigods. So you worship the demigods, it's a lot of work. So many gods to worship. But if you worship the one Supreme Lord, then you don't have to worship all these things. So, we, just like you water the plant, 
you put the water on the root, you water the root, then all the leaves and branches are nourished. So you worship the Supreme Lord, you can satisfy all of the demigods. Really, what's the population of this planet? Earth? The population is about 8 billion. Uh, the question is, Maharaj, uh, you are proposing that we only worship Krishna. So in that case, would all the benefits be supposed to get by worshipping the demigods before? Will be null and void? Well, you have to understand, when you worship the demigods, the benefit you get is temporary. It's not eternal benefit. It's Naam. limited and temporary. Because the demigods themselves are temporary. And the benefit, whatever they give you, they can only give it with the sanction from the above, from the Supreme Lord. So you are better to worship the Supreme Lord. If you worship the demigods, it's like bribing the lower government officer. Instead of going to the head of the government, you go to the lower officer and you give him some bribe. But you have some material desire, you want something, you can worship the Supreme Lord, you can worship Krishna, you can get your material desires fulfilled. And sometimes, you see, you have to understand, you worship Krishna, Krishna will fulfill your desires only if it's going to be good for you. If something is not going to be good for you, he won't fulfill that desire. So sometimes we are praying to God, we want something. But it's just going to be a lot of trouble for us. It's going to bring us problems. But Krishna will consider, is this really good? Is this really good for this person? Before he fulfills your desire, he will consider if it's really going to be good for you. Just like you may pray to you may pray to some God, I want to get a lot of money, and then when you you get a lot of money, then you get a lot of problems. Also, people start stealing the money from you, or people start cheating you, and you get so many troubles and headaches. <coughs> The thing is, you go to you go to the, some demigod with one problem. After you get your desire, you come with another problem. 
And then another problem. And then another. There's no end to your problem. Oh, I have the problem for the money, so you go to some God to get money. And then I have a problem for the marriage. I have to get, you know, the marriage is not very good. I have a problem. And you go to another God for that. And then I have a health problem. Oh, I have to go to another God for that. Oh, no, my house problem. I have the problem. My, and there's no end. One problem after another. It never ends. Now you go to one God and you worship Him. And then you go another God and worship that one, and you're going to so many different gods. Like a woman who has many husbands. No, no, if the woman goes to many different men, you're my husband, you're, you know, and she worships, she's praying, she's loving this one man and then loving another man, then that is not good. And so you, you say you worship the one Supreme Lord. Whatever desires you have, you can go to that one Supreme Lord. You understand? Yes, Lord Shiva is also Deva. He is a Vaishnava. Lord Shiva is chanting the holy... Lord Shiva told his wife. You know the wife of Lord Shiva, Parvati? Lord Shiva told her to chant the holy name of Lord Rama. Superman Tanadu Manavi Parvati Devi Idam Rasri Ramari Namate Bikumaru Purina. Rame Rame Namo Rame Sahasra Nama Bistu Yam Sri Rama Nama Baranini. Lord Shiva told Parvati, you don't need to chant all one thousand names of Lord Vishnu, just chant the one name of Lord Rama. Our Parvati Ram Kurina Vishnu Vin Sahasra Namam. I Rama Namangalai Nita Bikitava in Lai. Rama Tharadin Oru Nama Tejipital Bodhi Mandra Kurinar. Lord Shiva is the Vaishnava. He Vaishnavam Yatha Shambhu. He is a great Vaishnava. Lord Shambhu is a great Vaishnava. Sivu Bharaman Shambhu Adavadu Madhuram Vaishnava Ravar. Sometimes we will chant another prayer. We will sing uh, Brahma Bolo Chatur Mukti. Krishna Krishna Hare Hare Mahadevo Panchamukhi Rama Rama Hare Hare The four faces of Lord Brahma they're all chanting Krishna Krishna and the five faces of Lord Shiva they're all chanting Rama Rama Brahma is chanting Krishna Krishna Brahma Devani Chadur Mugangal Elam Krishna Krishna and the Jabikindrana Siva Bharmani in Ainda Mugangal, Pancha Mugi, Rama Rama in the Jabikindana. So Lord Shiva is also devoted. Siva Bharmani in Varu, Maburum Bhakta. You want to be, some, some people they go to, most people go to Shiva, Lord Shiva for material desires. Anegamano, Siva Bharmani in Dham, Baudiga, Tevagala Kagadan. So Lord Shiva cheats them. He gives them their material desire. But Lord Shiva is Asutosh. He is easily pleased and easily angered. But the people who get the real mercy of Lord Shiva, they will become the devotee of the Supreme Lord who he, who he worships. 
ஆனால் கிருஷ்ண பகவான் சிவபெருமானை ஒருவர் திருப்திப்படுத்த வேண்டும் என்றால் அவர் பரம புருஷ பகவானை வணங்க வேண்டும் அதற்கு சாத்தியங்கள் நிறைய உள்ளன that's why you have to be very careful adanal dan mega gavanamaga irukka vendum you want where, where the human life human life is like at the crossroad you can go up or you can go down or you can come back indha manitha piravi enbadhu mujjandi pondrathu endha pakkamum sellalam thirumbiyum varalam bhagavad gita said you die in the mode of ignorance you go into the lower species you take birth in an animal three body or into hellish planets bhagavad gita kurugindrathu ariyamayil nam ivulai vittu vilaginal nam keele solla vendum thavara pravigalukku muruga pravigalukku you die in the mode of passion come back here rajogunathil udalai neethal meendum ivulagathirkku varuvom and you die in the mode of goodness you can go up to the heavenly planet அதே குணத்தில் சத்து குணத்தில் உடலை விட்டு நீங்கினால் மேலே மேல் லோகங்களுக்கு செல்லலாம் but if you die chanting the holy name and remembering lord krishna and the glories of the supreme lord you can go to him அதே நேரத்தில் பரம புருஷ பகவான் ஸ்ரீ கிருஷ்ணரை நினைத்து கொண்டு அவருடைய புனித நாமத்தை தெவம் செய்தால் அவரிடம் செல்லலாம் krishna said you understand how his birth and activities are all transcendental then upon giving up this body you never take birth again krishna bhagavan kurugindrar yan enadhu pirappin tanmai enadhu leelaigalai kekkindrargalo avargal indha udalai vitta pin meendum ijjada ulagil pirappadukka maatargal avargal enadhu daamathai adaithu viduvargal arjuna you have to read this bhagavad gita indha bhagavad gitaiyai neengal padikka vendum we have it tamo tamililum irukindrathu ipo indha pravilathu namma nalladhe seniyirukkom ana namak kashtam varudha appo sonna namak kuriya indha karma andha karma namma enna sonna nammal theriyidhiya ore kadavulukku thandukku when we suffer people say that it is due to our previous karma but we are ignorant of that karma we do not know the reason then is it is it fair to punish <laughs> if you go to the law court and you are in front of the judge and he sentencing you for some crime you say i don't know i did that neethi mandrathirkku selgindirgal neethi padi sila dandanai valagindrar enakku theriyadu theriyamal seidhu vitten endral sattathil irundhu thappa mudiyuma just as in care what you remember you yes. did it you have to suffer ninai virukindrado illayo nichayamaga ninga seidhirukindirgal adanal ningal adai anubavikka vendum you cannot escape the law of this material world in the baudhiga ulagathin sattathittathilirundhu naam thappikka mudiyadhu all the devas all the devs are all witnessing எல்லா தேவர்களும் சாட்சியாக இருக்கின்றார்கள் and they're telling yamaraj yamarajanidam kurugindrargal ram yamaraj has got his secretary chitra gupta and he's keeping account of everything yamarajanukku chitra gupta nendra kaari therisi irukkindrar anaivathu kanakkalaiyum avar veithirukkindrar he's got a big computer system mega periya kanini mandalam avaridam irukkindrathu and all of our names are in there நம்முடைய பெயர்கள் எல்லாம் அதில் உள்ளது எஸ் எனி அதர் கொஸ்டன் வேற எதுவும் கேள்விகள் எஸ் பிரபு எஸ் மகாராஜ் மகாராஜ் சோ ஹவுட் யூ ஹேவ் சோசன் டு கம் டு திஸ் வேர்ல்ட் ரைட் திஸ் மெட்டீரியல் வேர்ல்ட் வீ ஆர் தி ஒன் ஹூ சூஸ் டு கம் மை क्वेश्चन இஸ் சீன்ஸ் வீ ஹேவ் फ्रॉम தி ஸ்பிரிச்சுவல் வேர்ல்ட் 
there is impossible for a spiritual body to have any kind of material desires, right? So since we are from there, how come we can have that kind of a desire? To so, uh, because we are Tatastha Shakti, we are the marginal energy. We have that independence. Either we can live in the material or in the spiritual realm. So when we desire to turn away, to get away from Goloka, get away from Krishna, we want to come into our own place, I want to be God, I want to be the Supreme, I want to be the enjoyer, then we come here. We are like little sparks of the fire. And the little spark of the fire, if it's not in the fire, it can easily be extinguished. If you're in the big fire, no problem. You're in the association with the, the, the Supreme Lord. You're in the spiritual world. That's the right environment. But as soon as you want to come away from that, the spark comes out of the fire. If the spark falls in water, it will be extinguished. It loses its heat. So we are like that spark. We have that free will. We, Krishna doesn't force us that we have to stay there with him. He gives us free will. We have that choice. Where do we want to be? Why does he why does he not force us? Because if he was to force us, then that is not love. Just like the man may tell the woman, love me or else. Right, okay. The man will you love me. <laughs> 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 so is that love? So Krishna gives us the you know, he wants real love, not force. Krishna Bhagavan Namadi Unmayana Anbu Vendam. Poliana Anbu. During a Maharaj visit to Sumapatani Yatra, the Maharaj told that we can see Krishna in the pages of Bhagavadam when we continue reading Bhagavadam. So how we can see Krishna to reading Bhagavadam Maharaj? I think we have read Bhagavadam so many years. <laughs> how, what is the process to see Krishna in the pages of Bhagavadam Maharaj? Srimad Bhagavad Tai Todarang Vasit Vandal Krishna Bhagavani Yaradiaga Kana Mudyam Indra Kuri Nirgal Anal Nagalam Todarang Vasit Vargan Rom Anal Krishna Bhagavan in Nam Yangal Kangarik Prabhupada. The one way you can see him with the eye of knowledge. It's a part of the Uruvatayala and the Nyanate. 
The eye of knowledge, you, you, you have to see through the eye of scriptures, then you will see Krishna. Shastra Tatsus. That is real vision, spiritual vision. To see with the eye of knowledge. Just like Krishna says in Bhagavad Gita, I am the light of the sun. Now you have all seen the light of the sun. Did you understand that was Krishna? You have to understand properly. See with the eye of knowledge. Okay, Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. So Hare Krishna. So hello, Bhattar Rukulakum, Rumban Antri. I am here. Mara Chodi and Amurda. And all of you are here. So all of you are here. Please, one Hare Bol. Peri Hare Bol. Hare Bol. And now we have Mara Chodi and Amurda. Peri Hare Bol. Please chant together. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. பட்டிச்சு <laughs> <laughs> மாராச்சே ரிக்வஸ்ட் பண்ணாரே நம்மளுடைய நாமாத்தா மாராச்சோடி எங்களுக்கு கிடைச்ச ஒரு பெரிய பாக்கியம் மாராஜ் ஒரு பெரிய நன்றியை மாராஜ்க்கு நம்ம தெரிவிக்கிறோம் மாராஜ் Uh, personally requested that to visit our Nimayana Mart and we are really thankful with Maharaj uh, visit here and hopefully in uh, coming years Maharaj will again give us Maharaj association so that we can uh, improve in our spiritual life Maharaj. So Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. And thank you for all the devotees, devotees for coming and please accept my dandwa pranam. பக்தர்களுடைய அந்த கருணை இல்லாம அந்த ப்ரோக்ராம் செஞ்சிருக்க முடியாது ஒரு வாரமா கடந்த ஒரு வாரமா நாங்க வந்து உட்காந்து யோசனை பண்ணிட்டு இருந்த மாராஜ் எப்படி நாங்க வர வைக்கிறது Happy with our visit Maharaj. Thank you. Hare Krishna. And I recall the one that Maharaj was the Darshanam Prasadam Puru Park. And that's what I want to say. Yaar Kallam Bhagavad Gita Maharaj Kayyal Kayyida Patta and the Bhagavad Gita Venamo Yengal Yadutla Vandu Parga Nanga Vangal Kair Padu Pandi Tharam. Surma Nandri Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Oh, I'm not going to take you.